I fly halfway around the world and an odd note is waiting for me in my hotel room. It says to come to the bridge down by the river. This looks like the place. I could really go for some Wiener Schnitzel after the long walk out here. It is a pillow bear prototype. Turn the bear inside out and you get a pillow. Very top secret. I had better not turn it inside out now. It is the key card for my room. It is my wallet and it has 252 American dollars in it. Are you a victim of the inferior American social support system? Uh, I need some whiskey. Sober up, sir. I'm glad Chuck is dead. Ruined my life. I have to go. Sleep well. Wrestle Trail to Thimbleweed Park, 1.7 miles. The sign does not close. It is just a sign. I had better follow the instructions on the note before wandering into the underbrush. I do not see a way to turn it off. completed step three of the note. Now for step four. So tell me again why you're here. I was assigned to the case by the home office in Albuquerque. There is no home office in Albuquerque. It's neat to know. Look, I like working a case alone. I especially don't need some junior agent messing up my investigation. Especially some junior agent that thinks I don't know there isn't a home office in Albuquerque. So stay out of my way. Take a lot of notes, sit back and learn, and I'll wrap up this case and we can both get the hell out of here. Your reputation certainly precedes you, Agent Ray. I'll take that as a compliment, Agent Reyes. It's how it was intended. I'm sure it was. Let's photograph the victim and head into town to talk to the local sheriff. The body is starting to pixelate. Body starting to pixelate. This is going to be a long night. It's a cell phone. Detective Angela Ray, senior agent. It's my badge. There's no film in the camera. <laughs> Thanks. It's a sample package of Polaroid film. Detective Antonio Reyes, junior agent. It's definitely my badge.
Smile. Now we can head into town and find the local sheriff. It's an empty can of Crockford's tuna heads, the good parts. Still has that fishy tuna head smell it's famous for. Appears to be a male, approximately 40 years old. Looks like he's been in the water for 24 hours. You can tell by the pixelation around the nose and neck. Let's see here. There's no wallet in his pockets. But I found a card, possibly a key card from a hotel. There appears to be a small hole in the back of the head. Origins unknown. The hole in the victim's head doesn't look like a gunshot, more like a puncture from a sharp object. Which is odd, because the opening title sequence clearly showed a gunshot with accompanying sound effect. His suit looks tailored, possibly European in design. Appears to be a male, approximately 40 years old. Looks like he's been in the water for 24 hours. You can tell by the pixelation around the nose and neck. There's no wallet in his pockets, but we found a card, possibly a key card from a hotel. There appears to be a small hole in the back of the head, origins unknown. The hole in the victim's head doesn't... Which is odd. His suit looks... We should go find the sheriff. Sure, I never would have thought of that. Well... It's a circus flyer with a crazy looking clown on it. Pretty good makeup though. It's an empty whiskey bottle. Definitely not the murder weapon. Wrong sized body hole. Signals are very strong tonight. Why are you dressed like a giant pigeon? We're the Pigeon Brothers Plumbing. I'm Beth. That's my sister Emily. Hi there. But remember, signals are very strong tonight. Why brothers, if you're sisters? Dad was expecting to have sons, and he was too cheap to have the van repainted. So we're just rolling with it till he's dead. Oh, soon. Shut up, Emily. Signals are very strong tonight. What signals? The signals. Signals are very strong tonight. Yes, you already said that. But what signals? <laughs> I'm just screwing with you. Dark night. Deserted road. Me in a giant pigeon costume? It was too good to pass up. But the signals are strong tonight. Very strong. This is really odd. Should I save my game? I wouldn't worry about it. The game was expertly designed to have no dead ends or death. Yet still be scary and have a sense of tension. You can feel safe exploring whatever you want. But I'd watch out for the signals. They can be very strong and disrupt the power grid. 
But playing classic adventure games has taught me to save often. That was true, up until Monkey Island. At least with LucasArts style adventures. Then the designers realized that death and dead ends weren't making the game more enjoyable. It was actually making it less fun. That seems like a sensible approach to adventure game design. It is. It just takes a little longer and requires more thought and planning. <laughs> but it really pays off in the end. You almost ran over a federal agent. That's a felony. Sorry about that. Like I said, the signals are very strong tonight. Do you know anything about the body by the bridge? Why is it whenever a dead body is found, suspicion always falls to the person dressed as a giant bird? Hey, if the beak fits. We don't know anything about a dead body, but the signals are strong tonight. Very strong. I think I've had enough of you. I need to find the sheriff and solve a murder. Nice talking to you, too. Boop. Boo. Beep. No need. The perps are outside. Click, 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 click. From a six-pack, you're supposed to cut them up before tossing them. Saves wildlife. Now I just have to... Flowers left over from a funeral. I don't see a way to open it, but I see a switch inside. The cell phone has no reception. I can't put it in there. No thanks. to stay focused and solve this murder. I don't see anything up ahead. I think the town must be in the other direction. It's the ET game for the 2600. I can't put it in there. I'm already carrying it. Wait up, eager beaver. It's dark, but I can see there's nothing in there. Willie's Watch and Violin Repair Shop. Thimbleweed County's most exclusive watch and violin repair. We re better leave it be. Closed. It says, need help playing Thimbleweed Park? Call the fully automated Hinttron 3000 at 4468. Hmm, I don't get it. Howdy, I'm the Thimbleweed Park Sheriff. I don't remember calling the Federinos. That's what you are, Feds. Hard to miss the government issue suits. <laughs> I'm Agent Reyes, and this is my partner, Agent Ray. Nice to meet you, Agent Arenos. 
Looks like you heard about our little murder Reno out by the bridge, huh? There is nothing little about murder, sir. <sighs> Ignore him. He's new. No sense in wasting everyone's time, Reno. This cutscene is starting to get long, and it's only gonna get longer. Let's find the coroner and uh, get you on your way. Wrestling starts at 8. I hope he's talking about on TV. The coroner is waiting for you in his office. Come see me when you're done. I apologize, Areno, for all the lights being off. We don't stay open as long as you city slick Arenos do at night. Even for a murder? Especially for murder. That makes no sense. Are we authorized to shoot people Arenos? The inscription says, Pelotronics, the brain of our city. <sighs> I can't put it in there. It's a police radio. Looks like it's on and ready to use. Breaker 1-9, breaker, breaker. Daisy, Daisy, give me your answer, do. I'm half crazy, all for the love of you. A bicycle built for two. Attention, all units! Enough screwing around. I've got a case to solve. It doesn't have any buttons. Must be for incoming calls only. Just a bunch of files. It looks like a big computer. Who? I'm the Thimbleweed Park Coroner. Welcome to the future, Who. Oh, these are the latest in crime-fighting computers made by Pillowtronics, Inc. This is all probably pretty advanced, uh, even for the Fedahoos. Oh, do enlighten us. <laughs> I love your sarcastic humor, Who, Agent Ray. It's not humor. <laughs> there you go again. We're interested in any help your computers can give us. They look marvelous. <sighs> yes, happy to explain. So happy to explain, who. Yeah, you might want to take notes. Already on it. Aren't you the Sheriff Arino? Oh my, no. <laughs> no, 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 who. Well, people say there is some resemblance around the eyes. But we're as different as Pisa Who's in a pot of who. Plus, the sheriff has that annoying areno he adds to everything. You'll never hear me doing that, who. Sure, whatever. Tell us about the Bloodtron 3000. This is the Bloodtron 3000. Put two bloody objects in, and it will match the blood type, printing out a report to who. Tell us about the Fingertron 3000. Right, Areno, the Fingertron 3000. Insert a fingerprint registry of known criminals and a fingerprint from the murder weapon on fingerprint tape, and it will do a match who. Oh, tell us about the Facetron 3000. The Facetron 3000. Dord, as I like to call it. Let me guess. The Face Areno? 
<laughs> no, that's what the sheriff calls it. You who city folk who crack me up. Just insert two pictures of an individual and it will verify a positive match. Did you use these computers to investigate the pillow factory fire? Oh, sure did. Four computers positively showed the fire was caused by the factory guard. No doubt a who about it. Could the computers have been wrong about the fire? Not these computers. Oh, the state of the art of who computers made by Pillowtronics. Absolutely infallible. Isn't there a conflict of interest with Pillowtronics and the fire? Whoa, now! Pillowtronics and its founder, Chuck, are above reproach. Chuck built this town and was a computer and pillow genius. Are the feds uh, looking into this case? It was solved uh, 20 years ago. No, he's just curious. He's a pillow factory fire buff. He's got a CompuServe chat room and everything. Fascinating stuff. This is all very impressive, sir. <sighs> uh, go see the sheriff in his office for a full explanation of the amazing Arrestron 3000. Oh, yeah, almost forgot. Uh, these Tron machines are fully voice activated, so if you need any information, just talk to them. It's like we're living in the futuristic year of 2017. I hate this town. Let's investigate these Tron machines, then go see the sheriff and get out of here. Lots of medical books there. That doesn't seem to work. It's empty. It's empty. There's a fingerprint kit here. Hello again, Agent Arenos. Hopefully, the coroner fills you in on our state-of-the-art Areno computers. That's some very serious computing power you've got there. Yes, sir, Areno. It's all state-of-the-art computer Renos from Pillowtronics. Absolutely infallible. You're also the coroner, right? Oh, my, no. <laughs> no, 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 Areno. People say there is some resemblance around the eyes, but we're as different as peas Areno's in a pot Areno. Plus, the coroner has that annoying ahoo he adds to everything. <laughs> You'll never hear me doing that, Areno. You, I mean, the coroner said something about the uh, restaurant. Yes, the Arrestron 3000. The last step in a fully computerized Areno arrest. The final link in the chain of a guaranteed conviction Areno. Every detail Areno analyzed and verified by computer. Moving on. Right, uh, sorry Areno, I, I get carried away sometimes. This is the big bad boy Areno you've been hearing about. The Arrestron 3000. Uh, just feed three reports from other Tron machines into this, and it issues a 100% Areno valid arrest warrant. Yeah, these machines are the reason we need only one law enforcement officer Areno. Chuck said that computers will soon put us all out of work, allowing for a full life of luxury. Chuck who? Sadly, Chuck passed away a few days ago. There was a big service out at the cemetery, Areno. Oh, the entire town showed up, which isn't surprising for the hero of Thimbleweed County. We'll talk more about Chuck later. I need to run a Reno and check on a disturbance call out at the old circus. Probably that stupid clown Areno again. Looks like we need to go talk to the rest of the weirdos that live in this town. We should split up. It will be faster. 
You cooling your heels in the local diner would also make things go faster. If we follow agency questioning protocols, this shouldn't take long. <sighs> Just don't mess anything up. I want to get out of here as fast as possible. Agreed. That doesn't seem to work. There's a fingerprint book here. Just a bunch of files. 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 This has fingerprints for everyone in Thimbleweed Park. Certified Fingertron 3000 compatible. No time to talk. We have to fix this slight leak. I'd really like to explore A Street. Street's closed until we fix this leak. What caused the leak? Well, the Hydratron's tube is obviously burned out. We could use a new one. A WC-67? Yeah, we're out of that size. Must have been the signals. Yes, the signals. It says, after 34 years of serving the Tri-Thimbleweed County area, we had to close our doors. We should have listened to Chuck. Transistors are a dead-end path. Tubes are the future. Thank you, our loyal customers. The doors are locked, and nobody's inside. ThimbleCon 87. It's opening later tonight at the hotel. I can't open that. I don't want to pick that up. 